Hello and welcome back to Cities Skylines, episode 2. If you didn't watch the last episode, we started a new series here with Cities Skylines, where we build a city. Um, city manager builder game thing. Yeah, watch the first episode if you didn't watch that. We're gonna continue right from where we left off in the last one, actually. In the last one, as you can see, some of them do require water, they say, but that should get fixed because in the last episode we filled out this. Alright, I'm very excited to be today because in the last episode we unlocked districts, which will help us out a ton. Uh, they complain about power... Ah, yes, that was going to be a problem, looks like. We do need to put up one more windmill here, or here. That should connect to the grid. Um, let's see. Operating normally. There we go. Finally. And that should fix the electricity availability. No one should have any problems. Okay, so. First off, before we start anything. As you can see, our town is called Centerico. Something like that. If I click here, we can actually rename it. So I need you guys' suggestions to what we can do. Um, to Not what we can do. To basically name our town. Because I think at names and making names and stuff like... Oh dear. <laughs> Doing stuff like that. So you guys should give me your suggestions down below in the comments. But anyways... Um, that'll, that's, that's gonna be a thing for you. Now, these guys are complaining about some sewage problems. Which, I'm not sure why. I think it was because we had a short power outage, and now some stuff has been clogged up, I think. Yep, that, that's gone. Okay, cool. Now, let's go move on to the interesting stuff. As you can see, we have some natural resources. We have a ton of forests over here. We will be expanding our industry area and basically setting up a district um uh, where that yet yeah, do dip uh, where do I don't remember where to do it uh, <laughs> ah here we go districts and we can set it to be forest industry so every industry in this district up here will be towards forestry same thing we can do with um with the homes if we go here if you see here, self-sufficient buildings consumes 30% less energy electricity, produces 30% less garbage, and generates 30% less tax income, which is fine. Which is totally fine. Um, removes the residential specialty of the district, returns the zone to the default state. Yeah, we don't need that. We want this thing. So, but first off, I can see the medieval demand for commercial zone. We want some more commercial stuff over here, I can tell. Plus, we also need a... Okay, so we already have a hospital down. We already have garbage stuff taken care of. We need a fire department. We need a police department and we need a school. So let us start doing that. We might even need to take another loan. In fact, let us take a look at the loan here. We can... Uh, let's see. We could pay that now and then take another one over here, which I think we will do. So we'll pay that and then we'll take this because we will need it. Um, so the green area is basically the coverage of um, this fire station. And I want to connect it to the main roads here. Looks like we might need two because we want one for the city. And we want one for the industry as well, because that can be affected. So that's going to be a lot of money. But this one will be mainly towards the industry stuff then. So if I put it right here, um, we should be good. I'm going to actually put it up here. We can always move it, so I've got to put it there. That will cover the industry area. Then we need a police um, station. That's going to be 12,000. We want that in the city area as well. I don't think this is going to be um, affected by it whatsoever. So I'm going to put it way down here in the corner. There we go. That should cover everything. Then we can choose a elementary school or we can choose a community school. I'm going to pick this one because it's part of the Green DLC. Um... Otherwise, I'm not too sure what the difference is, but uh, let's put it right about... Um, 
I think here would be good. I think this should be fine. Actually, we could put it here as well. I kind of want it in here, but I can't really fit it in there. There's no reason to extend... Okay, maybe there is. If we, You know what? Let's just plop it down right there. Everyone will be happy. There we go. Okay. Um, and continue the time. We used a lot of money there, but it's fine. Because we should be good to go. Let's speed up time here. And see what happens. Oh yes, we needed some more um, some more commercial zones. Let's add some then. Let us add some. Let's get our roads out here. So I cannot move and make a road here because that is in the way. But I can make a road over here. And then down. And then basically... You know what? Just cut it there. And just remove that for now we don't really need that we can manage with just going to here there we go don't worry guys a short power outage <laughs> it's fine no need no, no, no need to panic and we can basically just fill this entire section out here there we go that just that should fix that and we should be good to go Let's see. Let's take a look at some stuff. Crime rate is a slow, which is good. Uh, outside connection. Fire safety. It is good as well. It's good, good, good. That's nice. Pollution. We're not making much. That is excellent. Um, health. Healthcare availability. 100%. Average health is actually going up. Sweet. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Sense and happiness is good. Garbage is good. Education. Uh, looks like it is down. Capacity. Let's take a look at the school here. Students. Looks like we might need more, but um, we'll we'll look at that later on. So far, everything is actually running nicely, and we are actually slowly reaching tiny sound tiny town which is going to unlock landscaping perks and plaz plazas that 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 do level two unique buildings pet ban uh slightly reduced garbage storage accumulation slightly decreased happiness smoking ban that's good increased health decreased happiness parks and recreation nice uh kennels and oh that's a lot of new buildings oh my okay Public library in high school is nice. The other ones I don't use too much, but we do need them. We do. Oh, what are we saying here? Power. Aha. Running out of power, are we? So, 8 plus that. That should make just enough if we plop down another windmill. I really want to unlock some more methods of getting power because this is getting tedious and not tedious but expensive because now I'm going to buy another one and that should fix the areas that should be connected yes that is connected that's going to last for a little bit but not forever not forever okay so let's see here I want it to be daytime <laughs> We need to expand our residential area, as we can see. So let's do that, shall we? Uh, let's see. We don't have too much money to work with, but we should reach just as I said it. <laughs> nice. Okay, with that, actually, let's just take a look at what we got unlocked. Uh, what's that? Sports hell. Okay, that's 120,000. No thanks. Uh, let's see here. Elementary school availability. Ooh. 10,000. We could also get a public library. We could also get a Institute of Creative Arts. So that is kind of expensive. I think we, to begin with, we need a... Um, where is the...
I think. Wait, what? I, what do I have selected here? Community school. That's the one. I think we need another one of these eventually, but I'm gonna keep it running for a little bit and see what happens. Okay, we do have a bunch of packs and stuff which we do want to use. Maybe if we can find a small one that just fits in right there. What's this one? Large playground, uh, dog park. We don't need that. Let's see, another dog park. Let's see what we got. Okay, so what's this? Botanic garden. That's not bad. Let's start off with a small park. That's not small. That's big. Uh, we could put that here. We could also put a small playground. Park with trees. Yeah. I think we might need this somewhere. Let's see. Let's put this right around here, shall we? I don't want to waste too much time on this. Um, a little bit... You know what? Let's wait with that. Let's wait with that. Let's wait with that. Let's get our roads up and running here. I want to lead this road up here, you see. Towards the mountains. Like that. It's a little bit hard to see when it's night time. So let's just do that. And hopefully it will be morning fairly soon. Yes, there we go. Nice, nice, nice. And I think I want to extend the road down this way eventually. And I want to populate this area in here. So maybe if I just make like a junction here. Is that stupid? Might be. Let's do a normal road right here. Like so. Then we can do another one going in like that. Maybe... Yeah, something like that. Doing that. That is a little bit too big to just expand on like that. That is very loud for me. I'm gonna turn my volume down. I cannot hear a single thing I'm saying. Okay, so if we just do something like this, that should be fine for that area. And then maybe if we continue this down like this. And maybe make like a little thing here. It's all about making it interesting, right? So maybe if we do something like that, that, and connect those up. Maybe connect that up. Yeah, I see something coming together here. And then maybe if we just do some of these, go down, and can we make this go down? I guess we'll make this go down, and then this right here. Nice! So now what we can do is we can set this to be a, um, first of all, we need to actually put down a district. And let me just see here. Paint district. So in this district here that we're painting right now, it will be self-sustaining buildings in here. Now, I don't actually know where I'm going to put the buildings just yet, I think in inside here. So what we then do is we go to here and then we put that on there. So this district now has this rule on it. And now I paint this area with this. Sweet. Now what we will need is some commercial zone. So probably I'll put that over here for these guys to reach. Uh, they're complaining about power. Yeah, we do need another windmill. Um, we do need more power stuff. We might need to raise our budget for power stuff. I'm just going to continue that. And maybe let's try and increase this to 150. Let's just see where that goes and takes us. All right, so that is going to lead here, and I'm thinking actually to put this roundabout and connect it all the way up down to here. But that will require us to put that out of temporary um, use. So if we just, 
Actually, that connects up right there, which is perfect. We don't need this anymore. So now we can actually combine this big road with this one. Nice. That should be good. Oh dear. What just happened? What just happened? Uh, production 40. Maybe that doesn't count or something? I don't know. Let's just make sure that it actually goes in. Because they seem to complain about a huge power outage. There we go. Hmm. Apparently that doesn't count. Oh yeah, these guys need power and water. Oh dear. <laughs> I don't even have enough money to do that. Um, see, this is, this is what this game is about. You need to... You need to... Um, this is going to be a pain. Hmm. You got to know what you're doing. That's that's the thing. Ah. Uh. Mhm mm mhm. Mm yeah, I can't really do anything else to be, to be honest because I need to need to take this loan to make these guys have water and such. All right, let us um run this here. Make sure they have water and everything, and are happy, happy humans. Put it up there, I think. Nope, not everything in there is covered. That's bad. And just run a big one right down here. Uh, Straight-ish, something like that. Okay, maybe connect it there too. Um, sewage treatment. Yeah, that is fine. It will get power eventually. <laughs> now, this thing will need power. So, if we run it down here and down here and just goes into there. That should fix that issue. Hopefully. Yep, that fixed it. And power as well. Availability. We're producing 40, so that's good. Now, what I did want to fix was or do is some more industry stuff but it doesn't look like we really have a demand for that so I think we're good I think we are good now see these buildings are different they're more flat and if we take a look at these guys you can clearly see the difference there now it would be almost stupid not to put anything here but as you can see if we go into the noise pollution it is very noisy here, and I don't want that too close to this, so maybe putting some here or potentially over here would be good. Let's keep an eye on the garbage because this thing is not going to um not going to cover this area. I don't think actually it is look at the green area that is actually going to cover it um let's take a look at the education elementary school availability. Uh, high school, this is okay, but we need one over here, so we do need another school set up. Okay, note that, we need another school, healthcare, that's good, we need another hospital, so school, hospital. Uh, let's see, traffic is looking good, except for this bit down here, we can probably connect it up down here or something. Uh, fire, safety, we need another, okay. Hospital, school, and fire safety down here. Uh, pollution seems good. Let's see. Population. Uh, let's see. Mostly adults. Teens. Mostly families. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. People employed. Jobs available. Unemployed. 9%. We need some more jobs here. Ooh, industry is going up. Okay, good, 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 good. Land value. Uh... Okay, nice, nice. I don't know everything of this stuff. So if you guys know what some of these things are, let me know uh, down in the comments below. Also leave a like if you enjoy this episode and if you enjoy the series in general. Okay, um, what is the next city thing? Boomtown, okay. That will unlock a new area. We will unlock transportation, buses, all industry specialization, recycling, 
uh, slightly reduce garbage, recreational use, recycled plastic, will unlock new roads and intersections, and some new buildings, things. A cemetery will need that. I know we'll need that. Advanced wind turbine. Nice. I want that. Bus depot. Oh man, this game is advancing way faster than my brain can take in. Um, okay. So let me look at the natural resources up here. So we want a road basically going straight up. Cap. Boop. There we go. Now we should be in the zone. Yes, we're in the zone. That sounds weird. Uh, I must shut it. <laughs> Let's uh, put up some industry stuff here. Let me, let me actually see here. Uh, don't do that. Yeah, we got some. We got some uh, potential here. I'm gonna try and kind of box it in if possible, like that, and then. Uh, actually, we do kind of want that connected. Then maybe do a little bit of this. And maybe a little bit of that. Maybe complete it all the way down. And then maybe continue this and this. Like so. Yes. Yes, that looks good. <laughs> Okay, sweet. We don't have enough money. We're actually in minus, but we're gonna we're gonna get more, especially now because we will put a new policy or a new what's it called? A policy? What's it? What's it called? I don't remember what it's called. A um, what the, what am I doing here? Okay, re remove all that. Remove all that. <laughs> yes, we are a city planner. We are a city planner. Let's um. Follow this road somewhat down here, like so. Okay, good. And then for the industry, we want this to be forestry industry. And then we select this industry here. We have plenty of work areas for industry. And yes, people will have to come on this way here. Yep, 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 yep. Good, good, good. Uh, what does this say? What does that say? Yes, that, that's a thing. I know about this. We need a hospital down here. <laughs> hospital, fireplace, police thing, and a school. We need a school down here. But we don't have any more money. That's the issue. So, yeah. I think that is what we will have to focus on in the next episode. Because I am going to be cutting it here. Um, in the next episode, we will try and actually hold on, hold the phone. I remember some stuff getting taxes. Yes, we can actually raise. Actually, can we? Yeah, we can raise this a little bit and give us some more income. That's gonna probably help. Let's actually, what's this? Income from residential zones. There were one self-sufficient buildings. Okay. Okay. Income expenses. We're mainly losing money because of the loan we currently have. If we didn't have that, we would be doing a lot better. So I think in the next episode, we will be focusing on getting more money and, well, yeah, getting more, oh dear, someone else is getting sick, getting more money and, oh dear, this needs water too. Okay, I'm going to pause it. <laughs> All right, that's going to do for this episode. In the next one, we will focus on getting more money and getting rid of some of these stupid loans that, to be honest, I think was a mistake for me to take. And we will make sure that this place gets some health care, some fire stuff, and some police patrolling, and also some education going. Um, yeah, it needs a normal school, and we also need a a uh, elementary school. No, not an elementary school. We need a high school. Uh, we we need we we need more money. Anyways, guys. That's going to do it for this one. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, be sure to smash that like button. Subscribe if you haven't yet. And enable those notifications. Leave a like saying that I don't know. Get your city together, boy. 
because <laughs> uh, right now we are not doing so well on the money pit. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed and I hope to see you next time. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.